This is Fox 5 Morning News. There are a lot of new gadgets coming on the market every month, it seems. Some of them make our lives simpler. Some of them are just plain fun to fool around with. A lot of the latest gotta-have items are now on display at the Consumer Electronics Show, one of the biggest shows in Vegas every year. And joining us now from Las Vegas is Steve Greenberg, who is with the DailyLounge.com, also the author of Gadget Nation. Steve, it's good to see you. Steve, thanks for having me on. I appreciate it. You know, last year, with the economy the way it was, it seemed like a lot of these retailers and manufacturers really didn't bring out the big guns. This year, looks like it's a lot more to play with. What are, what are some of the new hot things this year? So many cool innovations. A great one to start off with. You've heard of surround sound. Well, how about surround sight? This is going to change the way we view our computers. It's a new bit of technology from AMD. It's the ATI Ifinity. And what it does, is it actually lets you take three monitors, put them together, and create kind of a panoramic image. So the video game, for example, will really surround you. It really does it all very seamlessly. And for non-gamers, you actually can use the same technology to multitask. You can put three screens up and have different content. Your stocks on one email on another, Twitter on another. So again, you're kind of surrounded by all that information. It, it really does change the way we interact with our monitors. And talking about monitors, this is a brand new monitor from LG Electronics. It's the E50 series. Super thin, less than three quarters of an inch thick, fits anywhere. But what's really cool about it, we get so much video off the web, it actually has something called Image Booster to bump up the low quality of web video. It also has something called Dual Web Feature, so it can optimize window size, so you can see multiple web pages at once. You can even use something called Auto Bright, so it automatically adjusts the brightness. So as the room changes the lighting, so will the mm. monitor's lighting. So again, it decreases eye strain. Great way to go. Over here, we've got something that's really cool. This is from AudioVox and Flow TV. They teamed up to offer live television on the go. So you can watch Fox Live anywhere, right from your car. A live news, sports, kids programming, a whole lot more pumped right into your car. There's service in 85 markets, including DC. So this is just very, very cool. And again, great way to watch Fox. Fox 5 on the go. <laughs> now, if you want to control your home theater with your smartphone, that's doable now, too. This is over here is called the Zentral Smartphone AV Remote. It turns your BlackBerry or your iPhone into a full-functioning universal remote control. You can control up to 16 infrared devices. The Bluetooth in the smartphone talks to the Zentral. The Zentral talks to the devices. A very, very cool way to go. Now, over here, this is from Duracell, and this is called the MyGrid. This is part of their power, uh, the smart power line. You put these power sleeves onto your BlackBerry, like we have right here, and then you just drop it right into the charger. You can use these power clips, again, right into the charger. You can hold up to four devices, so there's no wires, no plugs. You can charge up your devices just that simply. And finally, take a look at this, the world's first 3D experience without glasses. This is brand new, very cool. Uh, it's from a company called Q-Tech. And this is, now you can't really appreciate it at home, I get that, because uh, you're not, you, know, you have to actually experience it. But I can tell you, here in person, when you're looking at it, you see 3D images, but you're not wearing those stupid glasses <laughs> you have to wear in the movie theater. Uh, it's just a great way, to go, very, very cool. And of course, if you want more information on this or anything else, you can go to dailylounge.com. You know, and the thing with the glasses, Steve, because I know that the big 3D TV, that's like one of the hot new trends right now. You wonder about that, because if you're watching a movie, you want to lay around, you want to lounge on the couch, you don't want to be wearing the glasses. Maybe it's uncomfortable. Uh, so this is, I, it's, I, it's interesting. I can't say, I just saw Avatar uh, last weekend, and I was wearing those glasses the whole time. It bothers my ear. I mean, I just don't like wearing yeah. those glasses. Here's that technology without those glasses. Very, very cool. And if it takes off, I think we're going to see a lot more of it. So, uh follow that. I, I know before we let you go, I know this is just a sampling of what you can find out there at the electronic show in, uh, in Vegas. Do you think this year that uh, are, are people more excited that consumers are going to be spending this kind of money on these kind of gadgets this year? I can tell you last year there was certainly a kind of a pall over the whole thing. It was very, a lot more melancholy. People were very concerned. The economy was, was way off track at that point and people were really worried here and there was a much smaller turnout. I can see there's a lot more enthusiasm right now and I think retailers and manufacturers feel an excitement and they feel that 2010 is going to be a whole lot better than 2009. Well, that's a great thing. Hey, enjoy yourself out there, Steve. Appreciate you talking Absolutely. with us this morning. Thanks so much. Steve Greenberg Take with care. DailyLounge.com. Al?